native de Montréal, élevé comme Québécois, forced to learn the tongue of power. Baby in Mexico como alternativa, figlio del sole e della campagna, par les francs, par l'heure, aimé. Finding thousands like me, suffering. Mi cassé divorciente era fria, nipote de Guglionese, parlant politique malgré moi, steeled in the school of all Aquinas, querendo luchar con mis amigos latinos. Dio, where shall I be the man? Trop vif. Que puede saber yo? Spero que la terra be mine. So, here it is. The Two-Headed Man. Collected Poems, 1970-2020. Thank you, Michael. Thank you, Connie, for putting out this book. Uh, 50 years. It's a lot of years. I started in 1970. Uh, in this book, I took away sections. And uh, it reads from one page to the end and uh, there's a little section of notes but basically it's straightforward and I rewrote some stuff a lot of stuff I uh, changed things around and um, but basically I'm happy to put everything together there are a lot of poems in here that were written in different languages French or Italian that's new that's all there's a lot of stuff here that has never been seen in English and uh, well I hope you like it Amore. They threw me out of my house. They dragged me left and right from one room to another, from one country to another. They changed my name. They cut the curls from my hair. They laughed in my face because I did not dress like them, because I did not speak like them, because I was neither white nor black. They forced me to work for a paycheck worth as much as spit. They made me scrub washrooms in factories, hospitals, cemeteries. They raped my grandmother, my mother, my sister, my daughter, my granddaughter. They raped my father, my brother, my son. They assured me, they reassured me, they fucked me good. They put bread in my mouth and told me I stole it. They robbed me of my furniture, money, job, wife, and children. They sent me to school to learn the meaning of love, money, and work. They sent me to university to learn how love, money, and work were absurd. They gave me a diploma for losing my mother tongue and history. They taught me how to speak, swear, study, steal, work, and think in their language and history. They took my meal away from me and replaced it with bread and water. They told me I was no one. They told me I would find myself in them by being like them. They told me I was dead. They told me you were dead. They told me you were not mine. They sold me drugs so I could forget the color of your eyes, the softness of your skin, the warmth of your bosom. They told me you were a whore, a crook, a drunkard, an addict, a hypocrite, a terrorist, a religious fanatic. And when they called me the names they had called you, they spat in my face. But it took just one look, one kiss, one caress, one night beside you to rediscover myself and understand what I am all about. Now, if they ask me my name, I take the ink from your earth and be...